A woman from Hungary has done a big no-no, according to numerous members of the global black community, by putting on several types of African tribal faces. 34-year-old Baglarka Bola, who says she is a journalist and human rights lawyer, released Photoshop photos of her face morphed into the faces of tribal African women from places like Ethiopia, Kenya, and Namibia. The set of photos were posted on a website called Board Panda, but Glarka said that she hoped to raise awareness about vulnerable tribes in Africa and that she got her inspiration from traveling around the continent. She went further to say that her stunning portraits show how beauty varies across the globe and it proves that all of us are beautiful in different ways. Well, if you know anything about the history of blackface, you will know that the internet immediately ripped apart her attempts to raise African awareness, with many people calling it as they saw it, as blackface. But Glarka, though, was surprised at the negative reaction. She told BuzzFeed News that Africans don't have the same history as blacks in the US, and she wondered why there was so much outrage. The original post received over 200,000 views, and Baglarka has since deleted that post and replaced it with something of an apology. Blackface dates back to the early 19th century. White actors would put on burnt cork, grease paint, or even shoe polish, and wear red lipstick to exaggerate a black person's features, helping to perpetuate the stereotypes. Although blackface has its roots in the US, it found its way to South Africa, creating the Coon Carnival. Eventually, it was renamed the Cape Town Minstrel Carnival. Several other countries experienced or even still practice a tradition of blackface. You've heard of Zwarte Piet in the Dutch Christmas culture. So my question to all of you, do you think Baglarka's images of herself as African tribal women is considered blackface and is it offensive? You just had your news update with The Break. I'm Tracy Thompson. Thanks for watching.